What is going on everybody? Welcome to another video. Boy, do we have a banger today for you guys. I'm doing something very different. You know, every single video I've been trying to do some new stuff. And as you guys can tell, I have a Zebco 33 right here and we are going to be trying to catch some giant bass on it today i feel like this is just going to be a sweet challenge if you guys watched the last upload you know we did it with live bait if you guys haven't seen it be sure to go check it out but now i'm like man we're going to take it out and try to catch some giant bass today using bass lures so this is the setup i have I actually have a little ned rig with just a little crawl crazy story i cannot find the packs for these crawls but i also have some little tiny regular trds little ned rigs i can put on there but we are going to be starting off with this one this is 10 pound line on here which i'm a little scared about the reason i'm using this bait is because one this rod is very short it's going to be hard for us to get a solid hook set so that thing we can pretty much just reel into the fish and end up catching it the thing is if i had like a chatter bait on it would be very hard because of the backbone of the rod so you know it's going to keep it very simple with that little net rig see if we can catch some fish and um yeah i'm going to be ha having some collab videos with fishing with norm i'm actually in jacksonville florida right now and he's going to be coming out here he still has like over an hour left so this is what we're doing in the meantime i'm trying to catch some fish so without further ado, let's go ahead and go down to the pond. Let's get the casting down, the drag set, this, this, and that, and try to catch some big bass. All right, so we're at this beautiful pond right here. You guys have seen this in you know many of my videos. Here's a little rig that I'm throwing right here. Like I said, just a standard little old Ned head, little jig head right there with one of the little crawls. That looks so good. I wish I could find the pack of those. I don't know where they went. First things first, let's check our drag. Okay, we want this kind of loose because like I said, man, I don't know what I'm gonna end up hooking. We could end up hooking a 10 pounder for all I know. I'm kind of scared to be honest with you. I feel like that's fair, maybe a little less. Okay, Whew, here we go, first cast. Let's see how this thing even, okay. Okay, oh yeah, oh yeah, we working with something here. God, we, we watch us just start killing them on this little thing. It's just gonna be so hard to keep them pinned up and get a hook penetrated into the fish. This is gonna be difficult, especially with this grass on the edge. I'm kind of worried about that, like getting the fish on the bank. Like I'm just, I guess I need to worry about getting a bite before I get all paranoid on how to land a fish or how to fight them on this thing. If we hook a four pounder on this, I'm gonna flip. We should get slammed right here. This is bizarre. Oh, I got one. Oh my gosh. Okay, he ain't big, he ain't big. Oh my gosh, on the Zepco. Let's go. He's a fatty though. Yes, <laughs> look at that. Okay, nothing big, but we're, we're, that, that is perfect start right there. That kind of scared me. He, he felt big even though he's a baby. So gosh, I, I cannot imagine hooking a four pounder on this. Look at that right there. Beautiful first fish today to get the monkey off her back. Got a little belly on him. A little solid fish, pretty guy. Now let's get back in there, catch a bigger one. Heck yeah, boys and girls. That was a good little start. It was taking me a minute. I, I went to this other side of this other. Oh, I just got slammed. Holy mother of pearl. Hold up, wait a minute. That I can't even talk right now. That's how hard that fish is hitting me. Let me catch this thing real quick. That was, right when I hopped it, I was popping him in the mouth with it and he hammered it. I got one. Holy cow, that was crazy. Flipped it in there. Flipping with a freaking push button. Let's go. Okay. You were small, sir. You were very small. Son, calm down, son. Okay, little guy. Fish number two on the Zepco. Holy cow, there's fish chasing bait. Um, I'm an idiot to start off this video. I, I should have like early in the morning, I should be catching these toads that are chewing right here. And I got a little tiny push button reel. Holy cow, okay. We were, we were racking them up, we were racking them up. Calm down, calm down. Fish number three, like the next cast, holy cow. They're chasing bait like crazy. I'm not even gonna show you guys, we're gonna get right back in here, see if we can keep catching. <gasps> Dude, I thought that was a shark. It was a freaking carp fin. That scared the nebie jeebies out of me right there. I got one. Oh my God, what in the heck? I'm actually gonna make a quick adjustment. 
grab one of these standard little TRDs, take this crawl off. Nothing against the crawl. I mean, we've already caught three fish on it, but I want to see if they'll eat this Ned better. You know, just, just to give it a little test try. Little baby Ned. Let's give that guy a try. Who knows, they might just tear this one up. I do not know. God, dog. I can't tell this big. Oh, it's like a two pounder. Holy cow, he's tugging. Ugh. Gotta get him out of this grass. Gosh, he's fighting like all could be. He ain't even that. Gosh, look at that though. Pretty fat bass, gosh. Just tugging away, man, on this little tiny Zebco. Let me tell you one thing. They sure do put up a fight, and they sure do have pretty colors. That is awesome right there. Our fourth fish on the Zebco. Hit the like button for that one, guys. Look at that. Oh, yeah. Best fish today so far. I can't imagine when I hook up giant on this, because that's only a pound. I could not imagine just a toad. <laughs> no! Are you freaking kidding me? I just had a three, four pounder knock it out of the water and snap my line completely. Oh my gosh. I know you guys saw that. I don't know if you could tell how big he is. He was every bit of three pounds. He might've been pushing that four. We're just gonna call it safe to say three. He had it too. I lifted up to make sure he had it and he was taken off to the right. He hit it like a top water. I was kind of hopping it through the grass and then boosh. Son of a gun, man, that sucks. This little thin pound line that came on this thing is just not, I knew it wasn't good, but I didn't think I was gonna have a problem that bad. Oh man, that sucks right there. That was our big fish. I got one. Oh my gosh. That was a freaking big one. Look, he stretched my hook out completely. Look at that. When I lifted up, I couldn't even penetrate him. Look at that. He just bent that hook straight out. That was a large fish right there. I know there's gonna be some right here. I'm telling you, this wind coming up in the grass. Yep, he's right there. Oh my gosh. Yep. Oh! <sighs> that was a three pounder. I just missed so many freaking fish, guys. This challenge is a lot harder than I was expecting. Man, this is just aggravating, let me tell you. That was a two and a half, three pounder right there, right when I said they're gonna be on this grass line. Just pull it off. Let's just keep fishing, man. I mean, we, there's another one. Big one. Yeah. 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 Keep, stay down, stay down. Stay down. Oh my gosh. Are you kidding me? Straighten the hook straight out. Look at that. This is a brand new hook I just put on. I, I just don't even know if I should continue this or not. I've missed so many big ones. I'm scared, man. I got to set my drag a little less. I just got to start letting them pull a lot. Oh my gosh. They are stacked right here too. Just like what I was saying. On this grass and there's a bunch of wind pushing up on it. It makes too much sense and they're sitting on this grass line just waiting for that bait to get pushed into them and this ned rig is a perfect small profile presentation and they're just taking advantage of it and eating only if i could land these fish that was a very big one man that could have been like a four pounder i, I don't know how big he was but i could not move him and i could feel his big head shaking oh yeah I've tried everything, man. This hook bends out on a tiny fish like that. Z-Man, what, what the heck are we doing here now? Oh. Got him. He's not big. Oh, he's not bad. Oh, baby. Look at this. Yes. <laughs> yes. Not a big one like the ones we've been losing, but I think that's either our second biggest or our biggest of the day. 
I think that's probably our biggest. Look at that. Beautiful bass, man. Thank God. He was up here with another guy, I spooked one, and I was like, dang it. And then all of a sudden he started taking off with it. I'm like, okay, I guess he wanted it. Let's get him back in the water. Beautiful little fish. There he goes. There he is. Not a big one, but I'll take him. I will take you, buddy, on the old Ned little tiny bass. See, that, this rod can handle bass like that. That's, that's not a problem with, at all with us, but. These big dinosaurs, man, this is, searching for these big bass on this thing, we've had the opportunities. Let me tell you, it's just, we couldn't capitalize. I got another one, next cast. Oh, he's a little better. Oh yeah. We are finding these fish and we are really doing a good job with this Ned rig. Look at that right there in the top of his mouth. Next cast, literally. We're gonna do three casts, see if we can catch another. But gosh, look at that pretty fish, nothing big. Still, still dinkers. Bigger than the last one though. You know, we upgrading. What's up, man? What's up? What's up, Norm? Not much, dude. What's up, brother? Norm. Out. Look at this. We got fishing with Norm with us today. You like my new combo, man? Man, that thing is sweet, it's pretty. Bro. It's pretty sexy, ain't it? I know it catches the donkeys, man, but today I didn't have that much luck. Oh, just, no. They all came off, man. This thing, I'm disappointed in it, to be honest, man. <laughs> it's just not, not a good sight. And then we had the Ned rig, and just, just the hook started bending and stuff, man. That's no good. No good, man. No good when it comes to fishing. Have you ever used one of those? Uh, yes, I have. Do you have one? No, not now. I didn't bring one. At your house? At my house, I do. Ooh, bingo. Okay, okay. Well, that is going to conclude it for today's video, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching this one. Let me know in the comment section below if you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to hit the like button if you guys have been enjoying the content. Hit the subscribe button if you guys haven't already. And hit the notification bell right next to that. Leave suggestions down below. I love you guys so much. I'll catch you guys in the next video. Now I'm done with all you said. All you wanted was my bread. Got me messing.